Hey, I brought you something. Wait, what the fuck? You, you went up and got my bike? Well, I didn't want Cope getting it, parting it out. Jesus, Dick. Hey, I mean, I mostly did it, you know, in case I need parts. It's not like your gimp ass is gonna need them. Shit. Thanks, brother. That's the one thing I miss. Riding on the open road. Addie just wanted me to tell you that she paid some men to go get your bike and bring it back. It's over at the mechanic's shop. Oh, wait, what? You're welcome, Deke. Ricky out. Hey, Deacon, you got a second? How's William? I haven't seen him lately. How's Boozer? How the hell are any of us? He's surviving. Yeah, well, then he's doing better than most. Yeah. Listen, you need to keep an eye on him. What do you mean? Well, losing an arm is a big adjustment. He's given up the life he had. <sighs> Wasn't much of a life, Addy. I... You're his friend. The only one he's got. Boozer's fine. He'll live anyway. Hold on, I'll get it. Hey, Boozer. Where's it going? What's it look like? See you later. Make sure you plant them under at least six inches of soil. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set Open you free. About a month. Yeah, no. No, maybe another time, Cope. I worked at the Humane Society, had a small office and a dog pen outside of Sisters. Had maybe a hundred dogs. Strays most. A few weeks back, we were riding west along the old Belknap Road. We ran into a bunch of crazy assholes. Almost naked, all scarred up. Took a knife. Okay, that's your best bet. Right there. I don't know about that, Mike. We lost people in there before. We, lo we lost wh who? When? A few weeks back. Torres and Evans, looking for supplies. I told you that no, they were... No, goddammit, you didn't! I told you that we went after them, but the entrance ah. was caved in. Their bikes were outside, but the place was crawling. Do you remember? I don't even know if they made it inside. What's the trouble? Ah, we just... We're going over the papers, the ones from Sherman's camp. Mm -hmm. There's a mine that was getting ready to expand. Sure, and there's probably explosives stored on site. Yeah. Except now Schizo tells me we may have lost two men on the inside. Hey, I never said that, Mike. Well, look, I, 
Give me the map. I'll go get the explosives and like hey, people will. inside. What the hell is going you on? You may trust him, Mike, but I don't. Tell me, how much is Tucker paying for a box of TNT these days? No, huh? hold on. He's doing his part. Oh, really? He's doing what? Besides breaking the treaty with the Rippers, skipping work, staying out with Ricky all day, what's he been doing, huh? What you been doing, huh? Sitting on your ass while everyone does all the work. I keep this camp safe mm. from marauders, thieves, and drifters. Don't you knock it off. Knock it off! Hey, you don't trust him? You go with him. Do you remember some? Both of you, remember, we are all part of the same camp. That's fine. Fine by me. In the morning, we'll take our bikes and we'll go. We'll go right now. <laughs> now. Yeah. Now. In the middle of the night. Sure. You know, it's dark out. There'll be less freaks inside the mine. Oh, that's right. Oh, since you've been skipping work, you've been chasing their black choppers, and now you're some kind of freak expert. Don't need it? to be a fucking expert to know that the freaks come out at night. Okay, oh, yeah? come on, enough already! Okay. Okay. You want to go now? We'll go now. But I'll hold on to this. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Hey, look, he's got his issues, just like everybody else does. But he does his job. <laughs> Tell that to Torres and Evans. Deke, I guess I'm just making sure he's not gonna have some kind of accident down in that mine. Oh, Jesus, Mike, who do you think I am? I'm still trying to figure that out. See you when you get back. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Going. Lucky lad, know where it is? Yeah. <clears throat> I'll be waiting for you. Yeah, try to keep up. Deacon, you there? This is Lost Lake Camp. Over. Yeah, Ricky. What's up? I stopped by to see you. Obviously, you're not there. Schizo and I are on a run for Iron Mike. I'll be back by morning. What's up? I just wanted to see when we could get out, fix that transformer. <laughs> that hot shower still calling your name? Something like that. <laughs> we'll be back by morning. Talk to him. Geeking out. you were going to be waiting for me. I got sidetracked. So these belong to Mike's men? My men? But yeah. Torres and Evans. They weren't drifters, but they'd been out in the shit a few times. I thought they could handle it. I guess you were wrong. Shit's already been parted out. Goddamn scavengers everywhere. Skizza, why wouldn't you bring their shit back with you when you were out here looking for them? Because there were too many freaks. <laughs> That's why. Like them. Only a lot more. Come on. And Mike said the explosives are kept locked in strong boxes. There should be a set of spare keys somewhere in the office. Fucking notes. God, I hate those little suckers. We finally agree on something. The door's locked. Can you force it open? Ah, it's jammed with something from the inside. It's... No idea. Gotta find another way in. Hey, over here. And I think I can boost you onto this roof. Ready? Yep. Up you go! <laughs> Take 
think that's all of them. You okay? Yeah. Thanks for asking. There. Schizo! I got him. Great, great. Look around. Uh, see if you can find some flares. Wait a second. You didn't bring a flashlight? Yeah, but the batteries are dead. It's just getting hard to find these days. At least ones that have any juice left. Flares. Flares are over here. Yeah. Give me the keys. What, you mean like these keys? Yeah, hand them Hey, over. hey, hey, I got an idea. How about you lead us to the strong boxes, I'll unlock them. You got a problem with that? No problem. Just don't lose them. Mm. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna keep that in mind. I got them. Let's head in. Right behind you. Always need ammo. See? It's just like I said. Looks like we should be able to squeeze in through here. Give me a hand. Here, push. I'm pushing, I'm pushing. There. Wedge it against that boulder. Got it. There. <sighs> Looks stable to you. Stable enough. Remember, keep your gun holstered. I thought you said it was gonna be clear. I never said that, and I mean it. If there are any freaks in here, one shot will bring them right down on our heads. I heard you already. Jesus. Can you use this? First expansion area is right off the main shaft. Come on this way. Right behind you. Ah, shit. We're not getting none of that. Look at the map. Is there another tunnel? A ventilation shaft? Map shows they started a connecting tunnel here. Looks like it was unstable, so they boarded it up. Where? Uh, back this way. They boarded it up. Well, this doesn't look exactly stable. I thought I already said that. All I got is this. You got the flashlight. You had the honors. And they never completed any of this expansion work. I mean, it seems like one stick of dynamite will bring this whole place down on our heads. Uh, it doesn't seem so bad. Broken bones. Jesus. Oh, that was close. Yeah. 
So we're committed to this shit now. Come on, this way. What are you doing? What's it look like? You dropped them flare. Why? You got the map. This thing's a fucking maze. Gonna need help knowing which tunnels we checked. Come here. What? These are men. Yeah. Every time I saw Torres, he had on this same damn vest. Kept telling him, wearing bright orange is gonna get you killed, bro. I guess it didn't matter in here. Buddy lost the arm, blood out, and kept Taurus fed for a week. You want to resort to that? A few lines I haven't crossed, that's one of them. Yeah. Me, uh... Stand back. I'm not leaving him for the freaks. Get the hell out of here. Yeah. Come on, we can squeeze through here. Following you. That's a tight squeeze. You got this? Who sits on his ass all day in the camp? Oh, very funny. Come on. Okay, the first expansion area should be around this corner. If you're reading the map right. I'm reading it right. See? You still got the keys? Yeah, right here. Nothing. It's empty. Shit. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you not believe me? Sure. I believed you. Come on. Maybe they put them all in one place. Let's go check the other one. This way. Let's double back. Make sure we didn't miss any side tunnels. Excuse me, hold, hold up, hold up. This doesn't seem right. What? What are you talking about? This isn't the way that we came in. What? You think these flares got up and moved themselves? Maybe I got turned around. Oh, now, wait a minute, God damn it! Th this is the main tunnel. What? It's the... It's the main tunnel. You see the tracks? We weren't following any tracks on our way in. What the hell? But, but these are my flares, damn it. How did the... Oh, someone's fucking with us. Come on, this way. Hold up, hold up. Wait a second. in here. Come on out. Show yourself. Guess who put that thing away? What are you talking about? What I'm talking about is one shot. One. 
It's all it takes to bring all the freaks in these tunnels down on top of us. Well, I thought you said these tunnels would be clear this time. No. Ah! What the hell? Ah! Ah! Look out! I can't get a shot! Oh, God damn it! God damn it, it's got the keys! Shit! Where are you going? It's got the keys, we gotta catch it! Wait! Come back! God damn it, Schizo, it's getting away! I told you what would happen if you fired your weapon. What was I supposed to do? Throw a rocks what at him? You're supposed to do is you're supposed to fucking listen to me. Next time, try this. Whatever. You're welcome. For what? For saving your ass. If you hadn't run off, my ass wouldn't need a saving. <laughs> Will you let me fucking finish this? Yeah. I'm ready. This way. So, throws off. Addy said it looked like someone tried to burn his tats off. It was the Rippers, wasn't it? You got a point, Schizo? I had a drifter coming. Word's gone out. Rippers are looking for two men. Mongols, sound like anyone you know? Well, as you can see, I'm still wearing the cut. We're not hiding, Schizo. Carlos wants Boozer. He won't have any trouble finding him. But he's gonna have to go through me first. What'd you do to him? Gotta be something long before breaking the tree. Long before I... You know what? I don't know and I don't care. Have I killed a few rippers in my day? You're goddamn right I have. And after what they did to Boozer, I'm gonna go right on killing the crazy sons of bitches. Yeah? And Carlos is crazier than any of them. You don't wanna be on his shit list, bro. What'd I just say? I don't care. 
And I'm not your bro. Remember what I told Iron Mike. Carlos can go fuck himself. Hey, he's looking out for you. You're one of us now, right? Yeah, yeah, right. Don't worry about me and Boozer. We can look out for ourselves. This ought to make the old man happy. Shit's heavy. What are you talking about? You know the old man. Same with me. I got this. Thanks. He thinks that his treaty with the Rippers is gonna keep us safe. The thing is, they don't give a shit about any treaty. The only reason they haven't come down here in force is because they're too busy up north, hitting Copeland, the hot springs. Yeah, I know I was there. So you know what I'm talking about. The Rippers are coming. And Iron Mike is just gonna let it happen. He's gonna let those bald-headed freak-alikes wash over us like a goddamn red tie. Excuse me, so you don't know that. Right. Yeah, come on. <laughs> Jesus, never thought I'd be so glad to see the light of day. Shit, something else we agree on. That's twice in one day. Hold up for a second. Someone out there. Hey, bite. Someone's inside. Hey, you're hiding out there. Sit in your pants. Come on now. Find the Rounders. Come on. Find him. Mister, my boy's got a little rambunctious, I admit it. They're a little jumpy out here, you know? All right, uh, split up. Come on out and talk Let's to them. I'll settle them down. Got it. Watch your back. Hey, sister. I thought you just wanted to talk. Well, I guess that's all I gotta say. You don't wanna die out there. Give it to him! Make it easy on yourself, yeah? I'm shot! Yeah, you got it! Lay it into him! Think you're gonna win this? Get in there. The last. Uh, 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 I think that's all the bastards. Yeah. yeah. Come on. We gotta get that box of dynamite. Can make something out of this. The same assholes who parted out the bikes. Ride by and they see ours. They figured they'd make an easy score. I guess it wasn't as easy as they'd hoped. You know, I hate to say it, but we actually make a good team, you and I. Well, then don't say it. Hey, there's something I gotta say. When you and Boozer rode into camp and Iron Mike welcomed you back again with goddamn open arms, I thought it was another sign the old man was losing it. Going soft. Okay, what's your point, Skizo? <laughs> My point? Is that you and me? We see eye to eye. I get that now. You know, same as me. If Iron Mike don't wake the hell up, the camp's not gonna last another six months. Okay, still waiting for your point. Look, I know I've been busting your balls. We both know that. But a lot of people know what you've done. For your friend. How you been doing shit for the camp. Changes are coming, brother. When Iron Mike Retires, let's call it. I say you and me, we step up and run the camp together. You and me? Run the camp? <laughs> <laughs> That's
that's really what you wanted to talk hey, to me about. Hey, hear me out, goddammit. <laughs> Just listen to me a minute. Uh -huh. Look, I got a lot of friends on the camp council, and they agree. Most of them say the old man's gotta go. Yeah, that's bullshit, because Ricky would never go for well, She's as soft as the old Mike man. And Mike trusts you. Well, that's his mistake. One of many. Well, it ain't gonna be mine. Look, we all do things to survive, CSO. I get that. You remember how I said there's some lines I ain't crossed? Stabbing a friend in the back? That's one of them. Better one old man in the entire camp. You think about that. Where's Boozer? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I thought he was with you. Yeah, he was, and then he he took off. Some shit. Excuse me, what the fuck are you telling me? Get off me! Look, he grabbed a bottle of whiskey, he said he was going home. I don't know. Motherfucker, and you didn't even try to stop him, did you? Hey! We tried! <laughs> you gotta know when to cut a man loose. You gotta know when a man's done. Ricky, you there? What's wrong? Boozer went out, but he didn't come back. Shit. You heading up there? Uh, need help? No, I'll find him. Boozer, you there? Boozman. Uh, yeah, Deke. Yeah, Deke. Oh, I'm here. Where the hell are you? It's, it's getting dark out. Where? I'm at the farm. I'm at the, f the farm. Jesus, stay there. I'm coming to get you. Just, just stay here. I got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> okay. I'm at the, uh, the farm. Oh, my God. All right, here's the farm. This is where Ricky said was. Boozer! You there? Boozman! Damn it. Okay, here's the farm. Hey, where's Boozer? Who? Nah, no, there's no one here. More crew's gone home for the day. No, he's still here. The, the big guy with one arm. Yeah, yeah, I know who you mean. He headed off that way. Towards the old farmhouse. Thought he was getting a ride there. If you see him, tell him, tell him to stay here. Radio me or Ricky. Sure, man. Whatever. Open up. Don't got all day. Where would he go to drink a bottle of whiskey? 
One of these uh, farmhouses. This has got to be it. Boozer! This looks like it. Good book to read. Well, whiskey bottle. Empty. Wait a second. Case of beer? More bounties. This is it. All right, where? <laughs> Still got this beer bottle empty. Heading that way. Damn it. Schizo's right. He's heading home. He's on foot. He can't have gotten far. I'm gonna need my bike. Boozer! Booze man! Hey, Nick. <laughs> How's it going, brother? You said you were at the farm. I just left, and you are not at the farm, Boozer. Uh... Wait. Oh! Oh! The other farm. Dick, I'm, um... I, I, I went to the other farm. You know, I... I found a sixer. <laughs> so, I thought I'd go for a walk, you know, like, just, oh, walk, and sunset, so, uh, I just walked to the other farm, you know, oh, McDonald had a farm, he had, he had, ah, oh, shit, ah. Jesus, Boozer, what are you doing? <laughs> Boozer, are you in here? Booze man. <laughs> Upstairs. Okay, now what? Another bedroom. What do we got? And another beer bottle. 
that's wet or oh. I'm not gonna ask. Boozer, where are you? Booze! I, I thought you were gonna come um, have a beer with me and take a walk. Boozer, just where are you? Would you look around? Would you tell me what you see, what's nearby? Give me a give me a landmark or something. I already told you. Oh. Oh, look at that shit. Look at what, Boozer? What do you see? The road. The road's... Uh, wow. It's just... It's gone. Like, like somebody came and I don't know, just they swept it away. The road's gone? Oh, yeah. The, the, like, somebody came and just swept it away. Gone. I'm walking... I'm, and, and now the road is just gone. Where, where are you going, Boozer? Home. That's where I'm going. Home. Just stay right there. Just stay where you are. Get down. Down. Get out of sight. Listen for my bike. I'm coming. I'm not hiding from no one. I'm going home. The home. That boozer. Can't have gone far. Is the road washed out? What's that? Another beer bottle. Gotta take a closer look. Back on track. That's gotta be him. You're mine now. Blueprints. Bingo. I need the. I can't give him a ride without my bike. I'm gonna need my bike. Boozer, you there? I'm getting close. I, uh, I followed your tracks. Just like you taught me. Uh, Boozer, come on, man. Stay put, will ya? There he is! A little late for a stroll. Hey, Dig. How's it going, old buddy? Boozer, where are you going? Oh, that's where I'm going, home. Oh, oh, well, we can't go back to O'Leary Mountain. No, I'm not going to fucking O'Leary Mountain. I'm going to farewell. Shit, come on. We gotta get... You told me no, to you wanna take a swing at me? Fine, get in line behind them. Bring it! Okay. So this is it. This is how we're going out. Get out no, here, no, I don't think so. Huh, Boozer? Huh? Bro? Boozer? The nice year old lady was killed. What did I say to you? I didn't tell you. What did I say to you, huh? I found you halfway through a case of whiskey. You were gonna drink yourself to death. What did I say to you? You grabbed the bottom. And you chugged it. It was a lot of goddamn whiskey. And you told me that if I was gonna drink myself to death, you'd be right there with me. That's what brothers do. So like I said, Boozer... Is this it? This is how we're going out? Let's get the hell out of here. Going! Go faster, then! Cars! Rick, cars! I see him, loser!
That's the last of them. Uh, we're gonna be okay. I, I know. I knew it all along. Hey, hey, Pete. Boozer, listen. I just want to say thank you, man. I mean it. Boozer, uh... Just listen, goddammit. You came out here and you saved my sorry ass. Again. I owe you, brother. I owe you. No, no, Boozer. I owe you... All right, look. If it weren't for you, I, uh, I would have been it's dead me. a long time ago. Mean? Or worse. I thought you said... You gonna be okay? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, I hear a bunk calling my name. Hey, Ricky, I, uh, I got a favor to ask. Yeah, what's up, Deke? Um, it's about Boozer's arm. Uh, I saw that hook that you made for him, and, uh, it's great, but, uh, don't you think it might be better if, instead of a hook, I don't know, maybe with something like a knife or a blade or something, you know? Uh, oh, oh, hold on. Oh, please, thank you. So, oh. if it oh, I'm sorry about that. So, uh... You, you want me to, you want me to create a prosthetic blade for Boozer? Well, yeah, I just thought I might cheer him up, make him feel, you know, more of a... You want me to weaponize Boozer? Well, I wouldn't put it that way. I'm just fucking with you, Deke. I think uh, it's a great idea. Uh, I will go check some parts, and I will radio what I need. Cool? Okay. Okay. Uh... 